Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Guitar of the Day. I'm your host, Michael Lemo, and today it is Wednesday, so we got kind of an LP vibe, you'll see. Um, but also, we got these new shirts. Check them out. Summer vibes for sure. So Masa came in with like an 80s one that's like too cool, so we're like, all right, we got to reissue these. Yes. Some people think this is me, but that's Norm. <laughs> It does kind of have my vibe. It's pretty funny. I should put that photo of, I got of you with the glasses. Remember? I'll put it up. Okay, I'll not the, not your screensaver. One. No, no, no. Okay, no. cool. Because no one's allowed to see that. That is the worst <laughs> picture ever. Okay. All right. Other than that, we got a really cool guitar. But check out these shirts online. They're really yes. cool. They're not going to last long. Might have to re reissue them. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so this is an aftermarket case. It came in a road case, but this is a 1978 Gibson. Les Paul TV special. Ooh, okay. I love these. Such a cool guitar. Um, so this is right around the one of the first ones that they reissued. Um, definitely somebody played it and loved it. Um, you can see some belt uh, buckle marks and marks all around the guitar, but I think it looks awesome. Um, especially up here, you can see a little bit. Now what's different is it's got the Tunematic bridge, which wouldn't have been on the original. So you got two P90 pickups, um, three-way selector, kind of just like a Les Paul. Original frets, they look low. It's kind of like a fretless wonder, but it plays great. A um, little mark up here, but not really going through. No, no cracks at the headstock that I am aware of. Grover tuners, really, really cool instrument. Some people have been asking if this is kind of separated, but it's not, it's just fine. Just a little bit of a mark around the heel. Um, but everything checks out with this guitar. And uh, just, these make me want to rock, I gotta say. Um, they just strum real nice and they're real jangly and it's kind of got a blade neck, which makes you want to hit those first position chords like the G, um, A, and the D. But a uh, really, really cool guitar and uh, I don't think this one's gonna last long because people love them when we get them and this one's a really good one. So we're gonna take it out front, see what we can do. Um, we do have the blue road case, but it is kind of a nuisance. But if you want it and you do call about this guitar, um, we can show it to you as well, but this might be easier. So, but we'll take it out front, see what we can do. Let's go. Cool, let's do it. Check out these shirts. <laughs> let's see, let's see. Hey! Oh, 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 okay. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll do what I do better. Guitar. <laughs> All right, we're up front with the 1978 Gibson Les Paul TV Special. Super cool guitar, I love TV yellow. Um, we're also going through a brand new Fender Deluxe Reverb Amp, starting off on that neck pickup. Let's see what we get.
Oh, oh, Sorry, Mom. All right, here we go. <laughs> It's a Gibson Les Paul TV special. I don't think this one's going to last long. Just feels right, sounds right, um, all the things you want. Uh, so check out all these guitars at normsrightguitars.com and also on Instagram and Facebook. I'm your host, Michael Lemo. See you soon. Bye. Take that dollar. Take this back, yeah. What? Take what? I'm taking my dollar back. It was wasn't fine. worth a dollar. It, was it wasn't worth a dollar, sad. <laughs> it was worth more than that, Lemo. Thanks. At least a dollar. <laughs>